Yeah, morning. Good morning, everyone. A few weeks ago, I felt the urge to pray for California. I didn't really understand it much at the time, but I felt it was weighty on my heart that the Lord just wanted me to just pray for California, especially for the kind of contents that originate from here, especially movies and the kind of movies. One of the things that the Lord has been really dealing with me um, about is media and how the enemy has had influence on media and because of that influence I'm not sure if you understand but things like music and movies they deposit something within us and it may not take effect immediately but over a period of time those same things that we've watched or heard they begin to surface again after a while and I believe that one of the things that the Lord is addressing is the kind of contents that come out to the public and the kind of influence that the Christian community is going to need to have on the movies that are coming out, the kind of songs that are coming out. So this morning, I, I'm trying to be short. I just want us to pray for California that the movie industry is beginning to shift is beginning to change where we're gonna see more movies coming out which are Christian centered I'm sure many of you know about God's God's not dead one God's not dead two um, the recent one that had just come out that's called unplanned that deals with abortion that is doing really well and um, another one the bright ones I think that's from Redding California um, so we see where there is an upward trend in the kind of influence that the movie industry is having in the, in the Christian field or from the Christian background. And I really just wanted to just pray this morning and just declare some things over California. Um, one of the scriptures that the Lord brought to me this morning is from Deuteronomy chapter 1. And I just read about two verses. It says, after he had defeated Shihon, the king of the Amorites, who lived in Hesh Heshbon, and Og, the king of Bashan, who lived in Ashtaroth and in Idre, beyond the Jordan in the land of Moab, Moses undertook to explain this law, saying, The Lord our God said to us in Horeb, you have stayed long enough at this mountain. Verse 7. Turn and take journey and go to the hill country of the Amorites and to all their neighbors in the Arabah, in the hill country and in the low land and in the Negeb and by the sea coast, the land of the Canaanites and Lebanon, as far as the great river, the river of Euphrates, see, I have set the land before you. Go in and take possession of the land that the Lord swore to your fathers, to Abraham, to Isaac, to Jacob, to give to them and their offspring after them. I just wanted to repeat verse 8 see I have set the land before you go in and take possession of the land that the Lord swore to our fathers to Abraham to Isaac and to Jacob to give to them to their offspring after them I'm not gonna go much into explaining um, a lot of the the background from this scripture but as the Lord highlighted it to me this morning I felt that the enemy has had a foothold as it relates to media and just like the Lord commanded Moses and the children of Israel to go in and take that land I believe that the Christian community is about to rise up and the kind of contents which are about to be released will have a positive influence on the public persons who are not saved will watch movies and they'll give their lives to the lord the kind of songs that are coming out they will begin to 
pierce the hearts of those who are unsaved. And Father, today we pray, O oh God, for California and all the contents that have originated from here. Father God, from Hollywood, mighty God, the place where many movies, mighty God, are birthed. We declare, mighty God, and we take charge. We take coverage as the Christian community, mighty God. And we declare, O oh God, that there is a rising and uprising, mighty God, where the Christian community, mighty God, shall have influence through the movies that are produced, mighty God. I declare, mighty God, that this this country, this state, mighty God, will begin, oh God, to just release things, mighty God, in the spiritual realm, mighty God, that's about to shift media, shift the earwaves. In the name of Jesus, I declare and decree that movies and songs and the media, mighty God, is beginning to shift in favor of the Christian community. In the name of Jesus, we declare and we decree, mighty God, that no longer will the enemy have a foothold through the kind of media that is deposited. But in the name of Jesus, we'll have more movies like Unplanned, like God's Not Dead, like The Bright Ones, and so many Christian-based movies. We declare and decree that the Lord God, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob is claiming all the rights for his people, for the movie industry. We declare it in the name of Jesus. We declare it in the name of Jesus. We declare it in the name of Jesus. Tato Rabazike, Nantio Bozine. We declare in the name of Jesus that the movie industry is being given back to the Christian community. That the Christian community is about to capture new land. That we're about to pull in a greater majority of the public through the movies that share about Jesus and his love. We love you, Father. We love you, Father, and we want others to love you too. We love you, Father, and we want others to love you too. We want others to find true love. And we know, God, that the movie industry is one of the easiest ways to spread the gospel. So as a Christian community, I agree with heaven's agenda. And Father, we declare and decree that there shall be a uprising of movies mighty God which are Christian based to touch the community in these last days in the name of Jesus I declare mighty God that there shall be a spill off mighty God Father God in the Caribbean also mighty God that we too will have mighty God a positive effect mighty God on the public through our Christian centered programs. I declare that there shall be more TV shows, more movies that originate from the Caribbean and Jamaica, mighty God, which tell about Jesus and his love. We declare that there shall be short films, mighty God, which are released, mighty God, to share about the love of Jesus. I declare that there shall be new songs, mighty God. Uh, I pray for the political government of California. Mighty God, I pray, oh God, that you will begin to place spiritual fathers and mothers in the political sphere to cause influence for your kingdom. I declare and decree that the churches of California will begin to rise on one common aim, one common goal to spread Spread the love of Jesus wherever. We declare that the Christians are beginning to infiltrate, mighty God, different sphere of the professional arena, mighty God. That you're beginning to place, mighty God, new doctors, new lawyers, mighty God, more actors, mighty God, that are going to represent your kingdom, mighty God. We declare over California that the movie industry is about to change, mighty God, and that it will begin, oh God, to spill off, mighty God, in the other parts of this world. We declare it in the name of Jesus. Mm -hmm.